tell I'll tell you this, and this is coming from, you know, you you know how I am. Yeah. Like I always try to reference, you know, my career and like the path that I've I've gone through, right? Yeah, um and my first like four or five years in the league, I really didn't see all that much action yeah. in in the running back, you know, yeah. backfield. True. Um and it didn't take me until about like year six, yeah. five five and a half, six years to like really start getting noticed that yeah, yeah oh he could do this yeah, right fact. you know I I never forget I had a, a conversation with Shanahan um you know when I was w- with the Niners and yeah. I think it was like the game before right I had put the ball on the ground um yeah. and he was just he asked me a question he said like it, like what's going on man like are you all right yeah. you know and I'm like you know coach like honestly to be honest with you like I don't get any like good reps like yeah. I don't I don't get like any reps in practice and you expect me to go into a game and like right. hold on to the ball yeah. or like you expect me to like you know do all this amazing stuff that yeah. my talents you know are able to make me do right yeah. um or to go out there and do something special when I don't even get any any action in practice yeah, true. and he was like well you I mean you just walk around here like you're happy go lucky like you got a smile on your face I'm like yeah don't get this smile twisted yeah. in regards to like how I feel about my productivity and how Fact. I'm I'm doing on the field Fact. like yeah I walk around this building happy and stuff and you know I say hi to everybody that's because I truly am blessed to be in a position that millions of other, you know, athletes want to be in. No, like, and I truly feel like, you know, every day is 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 a blessing to me. Like yeah. to be able to wake up and do something that you truly love, like yeah, playing football. Like I've been playing this game since I was like six, yeah. seven. <laughs> like yeah. this is all I've ever done. I've yeah. I've touched grass from the age of six. Yeah. Every year <laughs> till now, like you like, know what I mean, like definitely. whether regardless of injury, regardless yeah. of anything else, like every yeah. year every since year. The, since the age of six, every year, every year, and I'm 31 right now. Yeah. Every year since the age of six, nah, I've touched the grass and, and put cleats on and played. Like it's different. It's so different. you can't sit here and tell me like, oh yeah, this is a this is this is something that you know he just walks around and he's just so happy about yeah, yeah I'm, no. I'm truly happy i really yeah. am like i just i just i'm just frustrated and mad that you see me as uh like somebody that just doesn't doesn't care, care yeah. you know yeah. like and so he was like all right well we're gonna change that bro next practice i don't know what he did <laughs> but started getting handoffs started getting looks starting I'm, my game just elevated so i yeah. like i appreciate you know having that talk but it was just like damn you really feel like that about me right now yeah. like because you made me because i'm happy and you know? that's what gets like i hope you guys are enjoying the podcast but i gotta stop you guys and tell you guys about these doer jeans and these doer jeans are truly one of a kind i mean they have great material you can go around in your house lounge around and then you could also be in your kitchen cooking up something or if you like workouts like myself you can also work out of them they're truly one of a kind so right now my listeners can get 15 percent off site-wide when you use my special url shop d-u-e-r.com slash motivated you'll want to take advantage of this because doer never goes on sale don't wait to get 15% off, go now to shopdoer.com slash motivated. It's can screw sometimes because, like, it's like I can't, like, if I walk around and I come in and, and let my emotions show what I'm really feeling on the inside, like, you're going to look at me a totally different way. Now right. I'm a bad guy. Now I'm a bad seed. You're a cancer. Now a, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, now I need to be weeded room. out. But, but no, like... I'm just like I'm just very passionate about yeah. about what I do, especially yeah. when I feel like I could be a a, a help. You yeah, know what I mean? Cause right. Like like my whole thing is I never want to feel like I wasted time. Like right. minds or, or anybody. Right. You know what I mean? So I feel like it's always could be communication and stuff that could be talked about to way all that could be prevented. You know what I mean? But right. at the end of the day, like I said, it boils down to you just got to know like. I'm still a player that had admirations of being an NFL running back and not just running back, one that played. So, like, don't take my like my kindness for a weakness. Right, you know what I mean? Right. Like, but, you know, it's like that moment right there, I actually felt like that was, like, the turning point in me elevating as yeah. a player, as a, as a person inside the building. Because, like, 
now everybody sees me as, oh, you know, Raheem's always smiling, always happy once yeah. again, right? But he's also a good football player too, True. right? I hope mm-hmm. everybody sees that, yeah, right? I, I, I want people to see that, you know, he's a reliable football player that can come, gets on the field and, you know, yeah. he's a difference maker. Like yeah, he, right. he really puts in the effort and he's, yeah. he's someone that, that, quite frankly, you can't, you can't mess with. 